Hi, I'm Jeff Alpin, the Big Game Hunter. I'm called the Big Game Hunter because I've been hunting down leaders and staff organizations for more than 40 years. Today I'd like to talk with you as a, a business owner of a small business uh, that may be involved with doing hiring now and offer you a suggestion for something that you can do and something that you should be looking for when you're evaluating all those resumes that are landing in your inbox. Now, you can read lots of resumes that don't fit what you're looking for, and you'll hit the lead, and that's fine. You may receive some resumes in the mail, and you're going to throw them out, and that's, a, that's fine, too. But I was reminded of something last evening at a workshop I was hosting where I had business owners, small business owners, uh, and potential employees together trying to talk with one another and give them advice about finding work. And one of the business owners there said something that it, you know, I thought was terrific. And he reminded me that what small business owners need to do when they're interviewing is when they post a position, where they uh, have something out there that's drawing traffic to them about a specific job, to try and give people a homework assignment to forward with their resume. And then secondly, you don't need, need to respond right away to people. As a matter of fact, what you want to do is wait a little while. And in waiting, what you're looking for is the person who's going to follow up and be persistent. You don't want to necessarily hire the one who's going to be sitting back and waiting for the phone to ring. You want to hire the one that's got some gumption, that's got some energy, that's got some enthusiasm for the role, and who may have done some research about your business and has a little bit of an idea about what they do and thus what they might be able to do for you. Doing something like that, giving them a task to do when they submit their resume, and at the same time, uh, you know, not responding instantaneously, but waiting a little bit of a while uh, in order to see if someone contacts you uh, is a great approach for trying to identify people that could fit your firm. So this is Jeff Alpin, The Big Game Hunter. I, I hope you found today's video helpful. If you did and you're watching on YouTube, click the like button that's down below. Uh, maybe write a comment that lets people know that you found this helpful. And uh, if you're watching on my website or come over to my website, the address is thebiggamehunter.net. Uh, and while you're there, I'm going to encourage you to sign up for a complimentary subscription to my e-zine, which is called No BS Hiring Advice. I publish it monthly with advice for business owners, uh, for HR professionals, for hiring managers that's designed to make hiring a little bit easier for them. You know, as I like to say, make even better staffing decisions. While you're there, you can read previous articles I've written for it, plus others that I've curated from around the web that can help you make smarter decisions. I'm also starting to coach business owners with doing hiring and other things with related to bringing on staff, including staff management. So you can email me at thebiggamehunter at gmail.com if you're interested in coaching. Now, there's also information on my site, you know, places that you can post your job listing to uh, with a number of services around the, the United States and Canada uh, where you can post your job listing. But the real thing is I'd love to help you with staffing. Send me an email at, this is a different address, thebiggamehunter at cisny.com. Let me know how I can reach you, what your number is, what your email address. Let me put some of my systems to work for you. This is Jeff Altman. Hope you have a great day. Take care.